YouTube Redbeard here. So, hold on, I gotta take a picture of this. I'm gonna shave my beard right now. So I took a poll, or I had a poll taken, excuse me, on the Shave Market and Shave the Man page for you guys to vote on which shaving cream I should use tonight. And I just added both of those together to see who the winner would be. And that is none other than the Lumberjack. Kind of ironic that I'm shaving my beard, the soap, for men with beards. So, <clears throat> my brush, gotta go with the fellow Utah, my Nathan Clark Custom Giant's brush. Really cool brush. Glad I took it from him. Um, after shave, <laughs> that's the back. I was reading the front. Okay, the bubbles. The LMR that I stole from Nathan Clark. I'm going to use his brush. I'm going to use the after shave that I stole from him. <sighs> it's a great smell, guys. If you don't have this after shave, get this after shave, and I hope the soap smells just as good. I can't wait to order that soap. My razor, gonna be my Titan. I'm gonna shave it off with a straight, and then um, I'm gonna go through one pass. I might get a second in on maybe the cheeks, I don't know, but I have my Phoenix um, with a Voshkar blade in it that I might tidy up on. I might not even tidy up on video, I don't know. It just depends on how I feel, because this is all just gonna be so new to me that that I don't know. Um, but I'd like everyone watching to have a moment of silence, um, pay some respect to my beard that has been growing on my face for five months. Uh, this is a big decision and it did not, uh, I put a lot of thought into it. It wasn't an easy decision, but uh, due to certain circumstances is something that, I, that I'm uh, gonna do and <clears throat> I'd like to thank Scott Austin Miller for the amazing pictures that you've posted on on the Facebook pages um, but that my this was the specific favorite my specific favorite was the one that had the expectation versus reality the expectation is that I'll look like Vin Diesel after I shave this um, the reality is I'll probably look like a, a naked mole rat um, with more chins what are you gonna do, right? I, I really, I'm just stalling, um, cause I'm nervous to do this. Um, last time I shaved my face was with a cartridge razor, um, my Mach Three, and that was. Oh, this is ner. This is scary. Um, that was a. A decent experience like like most of us have had with cartridge razors right now I'm just getting the hair wet so that it holds that um, shaving cream a little better it doesn't just suck up all the moisture and then make it a make it a bad shave you wet your skin down same thing with the beard I was gonna grow this out for a year I had a goal in mind um, like I said certain circumstances came about in life that are keeping me from growing my beard out for that long so my head's still healing up i've still got a couple couple scabs and whatnot but that's not what this video is about i was checking the length on my sides there's some hairs that are good Three, four inches. Uh, this is. This sucks, guys. But I'm going to do it. This is a real video this time. This isn't those pictures. This isn't. Uh, and this soap smells so great. One thing I am looking forward to doing is shaving my face. Often. I'm probably going to have to load this brush, throw some cream into the beard, mustache, and then load it again. Uh, I'm just thinking about Swivet's video when he 
when he shaved, you know, your beard just sucks up that, that cream and that moisture. But I'm excited to use more shaving products on my face. Because um, I think I'm missing out on a lot of stuff. But after I might grow some facial hair back. I don't know if it's going to be a, a chin strap. I had a chin strap before. Um, before I started sh growing my beard. Before I shaved and then grew a beard. I had a chin strap. Um, you know, I don't know. The... Shaving cream race was between this and a kilted tiki. Look at that. And the Kilted Tiki was just right right there close, but it just didn't didn't pull ahead. More people wanted to see the lumberjack cream. Hear my kids screaming downstairs. They're waiting up for me to shave this off. And they're like, we're not going to bed until we this sucks guys. Look at my head. With this, just with these hairs pushed down. Not cool. Not cool guys. But you know what? I'm doing it. So, oh I need a towel. Because when I cut the hair off, I am going to wipe it on a towel. See how much there is. Mommy. So, okay. I think I've got everything ready. To tighten. I'd like to thank Billy T for providing this razor for me. Okay. Here we go, guys. No turning back. This is the real thing. I gotta be able to see, though. See what I'm doing. grown hairs there that'll might be how you can see I'm starting to bleed but Oop. drop some hair there why am I doing this why in the world are you guys forcing me to do this? This isn't what friends do. This isn't what friends make other friends do, guys. I'm, I'm still kind of torn on keeping the mustache, though. Ah, the mustache has to go, too. I'm sorry, Kurt Davis. The mustache has to go. Oops, hold on, drop some on the floor. People are waiting up for this video.
there were some places that I knew I was going to get cut. And this is one of them. I've always had bumps there. And I cut myself there. Couple times. Just in the past with, with, um, with cartridge razors. That's just how it's been. I'm glad my kids are downstairs having a good time because I'm up here not having a good time. It's not cool. The hard part, well, that chin's hard. Um, with this razor because I can't I don't know the angle of my chin so that will help oh that's a ton of hair I hear my kids crying downstairs. They can already tell that this is isn't going good. That's not really why he's crying. That's why I'm crying on the inside. Cause I don't have a beard anymore. There it is guys. Not as, not as heartbreaking as I thought it'd be. I mean, it is heartbreaking. Um, you want to see this rat's nest I had on my face? Yeah, all that. I'm going to mail it to Nathan Clark. Get him to throw it in his sink or something. I don't know. Okay, guys, now that straight pass is done, I'm going to do a, my uh, Phoenix double open, open comb, do a pass with that. I'm going to drain this sink. It's got a bunch of hair in it that I don't want to, that I don't want to rinse onto my other razor so hold on for me one second while that's filling up we'll get some more soap on the brush the things we do for people I mean, like shaving our beard.
I haven't had shaving cream on my face in since October, five months. I did trim my neck a little bit, you guys know that, but. I figured I'm gonna use the double open comb because that's my favorite uh, double edge razor. Um, that's about it, that's the reason. Maybe I should go against the grain, you think? And then on my mustache, I'm gonna go across the grain. Maybe. Go with the grain, I guess. This looks so weird. I mean, I look weird anyway. I know that, with or without the razor. Chin. People are busting my chops because oh the chin's a hard part to shave. The chin's not chin's not a hard part to shave, guys. So you can stop that talk right now. Tell you what. Being experienced in both. I don't want to say experienced. Let me take that back right now. But having shaved both my head and my face. Personally, head's a lot harder to shave than your face, guys. For me. I had to throw that for me in there because I don't want to offend anybody. A little razor burn right there on under part of my chin. Not a BBS shave. I imagine that over time that BBS shave will come. I shaved up here, I usually don't do that. I usually have my sideburns down to the lower part of my ear, but I'm gonna keep shaving my head once my head heals, and I'm gonna I'm gonna do it again from there, and, and if I grow my beard and grow a chin strap or something, I'm gonna start it there, so. <sighs> this is a sad day. Sad day, gentlemen and ladies. When we rinse off, I'll get back with you. hair guys that's it let's see after shave for today again LMR okay these bubbles stuff you got to get this stuff guys 
It's great. This is not, this is called a post shave toner. And I'm not sure what that means, but that's what it is. Freaking my wife's hair is everywhere. But, gosh, it smells good. That's it guys. Beard's gone, sadly. Um, I will be growing some type of facial hair back soon. I'm not going to be like Swivet where I say I'm going to grow it back and then I buy 30 more straight razors and have to use them all. Nope. Um, but anyway, beard's gone. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care, like, subscribe. Well, you don't have to like this video because the beard's gone and that's a tragedy. But, you know, like and subscribe uh, to my videos. I really appreciate uh, you guys checking it out. So I got to take another picture right here, though. Thank you. Anyway, shave on guys. Take care.